So misunderstood, so overlooked, in a blink of an eye my entire world shifts on a day to day basis. Passion, goals, achievements, the hunger for greatness is both a blessing and a curse. Outperforming my competition is so easy, but my only competition is myself. I'm incomparable, but I continuously compare myself to the younger me. I'm trapped in a vicious circle that eats me alive, hating myself for not being better, pushing myself beyond a human limit. It all cycles behind my eyelids even when I'm at rest. I need to make a decision. A decision that will completely isolate myself from a general mindset. I cannot do it all. One man cannot change the world. One man cannot juggle 10 different goals on a day-to-day -day basis. It's humanly impossible. But that's what parts me from the rest. That's exactly what I call a blessing and a curse. I'm gifted to push myself beyond limits and I'm destined for greatness. But with that comes an enormous sacrifice. No sleep, no social life, no free time, no family, no happiness, nothing. Nothing besides the self-motivation, self-inspiration, self-drive, self-passion. I don't have anyone that can walk beside me and understand the visions. And instead of hating myself for that, I am now learning to love myself for this. I feel as if I found the answer to it all. So please, let me formally reintroduce myself to my supporters that think I've lost myself. My name is Jake Duffner, and this content creation is only about 1% of my aspirations. And with that 1%, I will surpass every single expectation that sets the bar for me. And without hesitation, I will stride forward with no celebration. Wow, what's poppin' baby? Welcome back to the channel. I know I have not seen you guys in a long time, so I'm happy to be on camera right now and I'm happy to talk to you guys. So what's poppin'? Leave in the comments what you guys want to tell me because I know, once again, we haven't talked in a while, so I want to see what you guys have to say in the comments. Go down there right now, but today there's something kind of strange that I want to do. I woke up this morning and I was like, you know what, I really miss talking to a camera because first of all, I woke up and I came to wake up Seb and this kid built an entire throne out of Mountain Dew. Look at that. His bed's on top of the Mountain Dew. So I was like, dude, that's hilarious. Why am I not filming this stuff? And I just like kind of got, you know, I was like, damn, I kind of miss filming stuff like this. So I picked up the camera and what I have planned today is going to wow each and every single one of you because I freaking hate doing this stuff. But for some reason, it always just comes back running to me and I end up doing it again. So I'm going to go downstairs, look for my Ouija board. I don't know where it is. I haven't seen that thing in so long, but I think it's in the trunk of the car. So I'm going to check it out. If it's not there, then I have no idea where it is. But definitely stay tuned, guys. If you're new to the channel, which you're probably not, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications. And if you're a returning fan of the channel, then I appreciate you guys. And just hit that like button and share the video if you could. I love you guys. Sorry for taking a little bit of a break, but I have so much stuff going on right now. Like I have so many things that I'm doing beyond YouTube and it's for you guys. Don't I don't want anybody thinking that I abandoned the Duffies because I definitely didn't. If anything, I'm just bringing the Duffies higher up to do greater things in the world. That's what I want to do. So just don't ever think that I abandoned you guys. I'm sorry that everybody was freaking out on like all my social media and stuff like that. It's not like that, trust me. I have a lot of stuff planned and it's all based off you guys. So don't ever think that I left you guys. Hello. Rumor has it that you wipe old man balls. Yep, that's me. <laughs> she does do it too. She don't want to talk when the camera comes on but she was just talking about it. How she wipes old man's balls because she works at a hospital and helps all the old people. Don't get shy just because the camera's out. Go ahead, tell them. I'm not shy. Tell I wipe them. balls. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. What up, Adamir? How you doing? What up? <laughs> I love it because- You get younger, bro. What? Adam got younger. He did, bro. You're you're freaking killing it. He shaved, that's why. It's because he shaved, yeah. I love how everybody in the comments might actually think that's Adam here. Because <laughs> like, they haven't seen Adam here in like six like, years. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, oh my god, Adam here really just does look amazing, bro. <laughs> 
flip check on concrete right now. You gotta do it for the Duffies. Send it, bro. They think that we abandoned them. Never that. So you gotta throw a flip check on concrete. No shoes. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that shit hurt or what? Nah. It didn't? Actually, nah. I'm about to throw one too. Yeah, you gonna throw a flip check? Dude, the thing is, you got thick socks on. Hey, it got, don't matter. Little, it don't matter. Yeah, I'm pretty much barefoot right now, bro. <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh, you got it, though. Oh. Oh, that you got it. That didn't hurt at all? Oh, that didn't hurt. Oh. <laughs> I stung a little bit. <laughs> oh. I didn't have to do much looking because I popped the trunk and it's the first thing on top. Right? Oh, we it ain't like the original though. It's not like my original Ouija board. I have no idea where that went. Oh yeah, I tore it up and buried it and stuff. Actually, that's where it went. But this is like a new one that I bought like not too long ago, but I've only used it like one time. There it is. Ooh, the shoot. Ouija board, bro. This thing ruined my life. Wait, I don't think I've ever even used this. You definitely haven't. I haven't seen that in any... Wait, I think this is brand new. I can't recall, bro. Let me know in the comments you, right now. Nah, it is because when you bought it, we were going to do it. And then you were like, nah. I, and you got your old one. And you just used your old one. Nah, I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Did I use this in, the, in any videos yet or not? Because I have no idea. But I have it here. And I don't know. I'm thinking about maybe... Sending it for the Duffies for old times sake, but I'm kind of nervous. I'm gonna bring it inside right now and see what everybody else You're gonna to bring it inside? Yeah. Don't bring it inside. It's not even used yet. So what? Not haunted. <laughs> Excuse me everybody when gen board come through but when gen get out of here. When gen boards coming through Apple when gen get out of here Jake Where The when gen board is in me household Everybody's scared of it, but you know me I ain't scared of it. I'll play this with my nutsack. <laughs> you made pizza bagels? Yep, for me. Let me get one of them. No! Come on! No! You're making me touch all, every single one that, you just made me touch all of them, so. You didn't put your finger on it. Yes, I, okay, I didn't. Wait a minute, no. wait a minute! You stole my pizza rolls and now you're gonna steal her pizza bagels? <laughs> I like my pizza ingredients, bruh. Okay, here we go. Super weird angle I have the camera at, but that's just because I have no one else here in the house that can help me film this. So I have a tripod on right now pointing down so you guys can see an angle of the Ouija board right here. Hopefully you guys can see it anyways. But I don't know if this board actually works yet because I don't think that I've ever tried this exact board. So I don't know if there's a spirit attached to it. I'm pretty sure that my apartment has no spirits in it so this won't be able to contact any spirits unless there's one that is attached to it. So I don't know if this is gonna work. That's why I wanna try it here first. And if it doesn't work here, that means that I have to go to an actual haunted place in order to contact any spirits. Oh my God, I don't know why I just got the chills when I said that, but oh God, I just got the chills. Anyways, I hope you guys are ready to get this Ouija board session started because I'm not, so I hope you guys are. <laughs> Are there any spirits here that would like to contact me tonight? Oh God, my heart is pounding. I don't know why I've done this a million times, but every single time I do it, I get the same adrenaline rush. Are there any spirits here that would like to contact me tonight? If so, please move the planchette to yes. Okay, one more time. Are there any spirits in the premises? If so, could you please move the planchette to yes? What the hell? Oh my God. What the hell? The piece didn't move. Wow. 
What the actual? Was my bed not made? There's a... There's a piss stain right there, I think. That's piss. There's a... There's a... Alright, maybe, maybe this uh, board thing wasn't a good idea. Put this away right now. That smells like piss. Yo, yo, I'm not even joking right now. Like, this isn't even a joke for the camera. I'm not, I'm not joking. The bed's all messed up and there's piss right there. How could that happen? in 10 seconds.